A Black Panther fans lined up for hours this morning to get a copy of the exclusive Oakland cover of the new Black Panther comic. KPX 5 reporter Jessica Flores was there as the doors opened. The line wraps around the building here. Now, the owner tells me he ordered 3,000 copies. 2,500 were pre ordered. That means there's only 500 inside the store for purchase. Welcome to Oakland, the city making its mark in the comic world here on Marvel's new Black Panther issue number one. Day one is a total. The exclusive version features the sign and iconic Port of Oakland cranes, and this cover only available at Cape and Cowl, where store owner Aton Manhoff worked with Marvel to bring the cover to life. And they said, okay, well, here's 10 hoops for you to jump through. I said, okay, sure, I'll do that. Um, I'll jump through all the hoops as long as it can be an Oakland themed cover. The nod to Oakland comes on the heels of the blockbuster Black Panther movie, directed by Oakland's own Ryan Coogler. With the movie coming out and like my generation is being so young, like it just gives me a chance to like get into the comic book scene. You know, I've been in the town 45 years, 11 months. You know, town representative. You know what I mean? You know, it's a good movie. It's a black. You know what I'm saying? You know, superhero. Love that. You know, it's all about the representation. And though Oakland plays a role in the movie. It's not part of this comic book series. Thanks for making it down. This, this book on the inside actually doesn't have anything to do with Oakland. It's in space. Uh, so um, it's all about Wakanda. In space or in Oakland, for $4.99, some fans getting a piece of Wakanda forever. Okay. Still for others, it's off to the highest Thank bidder. You. I'm sure we're going to see a few copies on eBay tonight. You know, we'll see what happens with that. In Oakland, Jessica Flores, KPIX 5.